Thanks for joining me. I'm Paul, and let's see what our question is for today. Two left to go. Whoop. Don't lose that last little rascal. Ooh, that was smooth. All right, George from Lakeside, California writes, why does PS Audio not manufacture 20 amp IEC power cords? <laughs> Would the BHK power amp and the P10 regenerator be better served with 20 amp power cords attached to 20 amp receptacles on the unit? That's a really interesting question. Now, one of the reasons that we don't typically make 20 amp power cords or receptacles is that they are fairly rare in use. So imagine if you look out over the marketplace of standard power cables, you'll see that almost all aftermarket power cables are 15 amp. So if we made, let's say, a power plant or the BHK amplifier with 20 amp IEC input, then you would be restricted as a customer to only being able to power it on a 20 amp circuit. And you may, A, not have one, B, you may not have in your collection of aftermarket cables, you may not have a 20 amp power cable. We've just narrowed the field down dramatically. And for what purpose? The BHK amplifier would really not benefit from having a 20 amp connector. Not really, because at the end of the day, we're not drawing that much current. A power plant's a different story. Now, we are currently working on a, what's called a P20 power amplifier and this beast is huge it's 25 percent taller and bigger by power and by physical size than the p10 now the p10 draws every bit out of the wall that a 15 amp circuit will allow so we can't draw any more than what's available by a 15 amp circuit in order to make a bigger power plant which is what the p20 is we're going to have to get a bigger circuit to it and there we're going to need a 20 amp but the same practical restrictions on aftermarket power cables what the user might have at home what he can plug it into I, I just I think about you get this you, you, your new power plant home and you hook it up and you realize oh gosh I don't have a 20 amp connector I can't even plug the thing in at all I can't use it. You don't want to use an adapter. So that just seems kind of restrictive. What we did on the P20, which I think is pretty cool, and this took a lot of work with regulatory agencies and, and our engineering team. We have both a 20 amp and a 15 amp, but they are segregated. You can't use you know one while you're trying to use the other. And we were able to pull this off with a, this door and micro switches, but it allows you to open this and run it on a 15 amp. You won't get as much power, but at least you get to take it home and run it and use it. And then if you need to call an electrician or whatever you need to do to upgrade to that 20 amp connector, the appropriate safe wiring and the circuit breaker to accommodate all that, then you can pull that out, slide the door over, get yourself a really beefy 20 amp cable, plug it in, you're good to go. Hope that answers your question. Thanks. It was a good one.